Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Happy spring. This is my favorite time of the year just because the sun is out a little bit longer. I see that pastels are rotating back in, not just in handbags, but in accessories and in fashion. And it's just a fun season to be in. Um, so if this is your first time here, we talk handbags on this channel um, from contemporary to designer and just anything handbag related. So if that's something you like, make sure you Subscribe and let's get started. So today I wanted to talk about handbags for $500 or less. Just if you are looking for something that you're not sure about, or you're just looking for something that's trendy, but you don't want to necessarily invest in, um, here are some alternatives that I personally really love and I just wanted to share them with you guys. So with that said, let's start with one of the my favorite contemporary brands and that is Tory Burch. Tory Burch, as you guys I'm sure all know, is makes handbag, apparel, shoes, accessories, everything and anything. And I love them because it's such a good price point for what you get. And there's so many colors, there's so many options. Okay, so this is an oldie for me, but goodie. Um, and again, I have the stored away. So I kind of just pull things out of my So this room. is the Tory Birch Perry Tote. And I love this bag because it's just so like easy to use and it's like a mini tote. So you get that tote feel but without carrying everything. If you're not, you know, bring your laptop or using it for work, this is the bag you would want to get. It's a great weekend bag, great travel bag. Um, but I've done a review on here. I'll drop it below. But you can see that it is just a button closure. It has a middle compartment where I still have things in it, I didn't even realize. And then you have your compartment here, which I still have my cosmetic bag and then my wallet, but you can see. So it's divided in three um, and I love this. This is a pebbled leather, so you can see that it's really nice material. They have, um, it has a crossbody. So if you wanted just to carry it as a tote without the straps, you can. Um, and I think it just is, you know, obviously this comes in other fun colors, comes in, I think, pastels, greens, blues. Um, I just went for a very simple neutral black just because it matches with everything. And I think this could work for all seasons. Um, and I love that cognac brown that gives it kind of a contrast. But yeah, this price point is so good. I'll drop everything below. I don't know top of my head, but I believe this is around 250. So you really get a lot um, of bag for the price. second bag. You guys know I've done many videos on this. I'll drop it below too. Is the Kira wallet on chain. And I love this bag because it's a lambskin. So you get that like squishy feel, but it's so small that it's just, when you wear this, you feel like you're not wearing anything and it's casual enough, but also kind of dressed up enough. So it's like a great contemporary bag. Um, and you guys, I'm sure have seen my reviews on this, but again, I have a lot of stuff in here, but it's just, again, in compartments like this. And I would say this fits the same as the YSL wallet on chain, also fits the same as even, a, I think, a Chanel wallet on chain. This might actually fit a little bit more. Um, and again, this price point, I think, is around 350 You get really good quality for the price. And Tory Burch is doing their spring sale, I believe, right now. Or maybe it just ended. I'm not 100% sure. Those are the Tory Burch bags. Um, another one, a Kira, actually, that's a wallet on chain, but Kira comes in many other sizes too. I'll throw it up on the screen. Um, but again, it has like the almost like the YSL poofy feel, which I personally really like. And then also, I don't have this bag, but I've seen, you know, videos on it. And that's the Rebecca Minkoff Eddie Flap Maxi bag. Again, I'll throw it on screen, but you see the big Chevron puffs. It totally gives me the YSL Lulu bag vibe. So if you don't know about the Lulu bag, you're not sure that you like the puffiness of that. Um, you're looking at, I believe this one retails for about $350 um, versus you know YSL if you're looking at a smaller range, just 2000 plus. So bit, again, big price difference. So just something to think about if you're looking for um, that same look and feel, but at a more affordable price. I don't know about you guys, but lately I've been really feeling the Bottega Veneta vibes. They just have some from their cassette bag, 
um, to their, I don't even know what they're called, but like the dumpling bags. They're just so cute and they come in so many colors. I love the green. I love the like sky blue. Um, it's just so, so, so cute. But for me personally, I just don't know if I want to necessarily invest 100% in a bag that I'm not sure I can use every single day for my lifestyle. Um, I just prefer something on the more casual side, but doesn't mean I don't love it. Doesn't mean I actually don't want one, but what I actually recently found were these two bags. And again, I love that like dumpling feel. Um, and this one actually is a great dupe. It has Bottega Veneta vibes and it's a dumpling just like this and it opens up so you can see it still has the stuffing in it. Um, but again, same thing. I don't know if I love, I mean, I do like the chain on this, but I would probably just take this off. You can remove these. These are just adjustable. Um, and then you can just carry this as a clutch. So again, if I'm not 100% sure I want to invest in it, maybe in the future I will, but I thought I would try this out first. And if it worked for my lifestyle, I would definitely consider looking at the Bottega. Um, but this is another option. And this one is just from Target and I was attracted to this bag because I love this color. So I think my favorite colors this season is obviously you guys can see is a lilac and I've been loving this like, I don't even know what kind of blue this would be. But yeah, it's just, it's so pretty because it's like a bluish purplish color. And I thought that this will be perfect for spring. Again, it's not something I would use every day, but with a cute like sundress, or if you just wanna have a pop of pastel, it's so cute, you can just carry it like this, hold it like this. It does have D-rings on here, um, so you can attach your own you know, straps, whether they're small straps or just a long strap. This comes with a strap too. Um, like this, I don't love the strap in this, but I just like the color. So I figure, you know what, even if I use it a couple times, it's really, really affordable. Um, again, this is just from Target. And this one actually right here is from Amazon. Such a great deal. I think this one was under $50 and so was this one. So again, you guys, if you wanna try this bag, you're not 100% sure if Bottega is the way to go, um, I'll drop these below. And it's definitely something fun just to have, you know, rotating in your wardrobe. Let's talk about Coach. Now, I am not a Coach lover, but recently Coach have really been upping their game. And I, if you guys watch YouTube videos, if you guys, you know, go online, go on social media, you know the it bag right now on the in the Coach world is the Tabby Pillow 26. And honestly, like when I first saw it, I was like, no, um, but lately, I'm not gonna lie, I've really been loving th that bag, and I actually saw it in person um, at Nordstrom, and I looked at it, and I felt it, and it was this Napa leather, and it was just so squishy, and it's it's so just yummy looking, and I almost wanted to bite it. It's just, it's such a pretty bag, and I really believe that that bag is really gonna bring Coach to that next level to where they deserve to be, because their quality really is there for the price. Um, and I'll throw it up on screen because it comes in beautiful, this like candy orange, this cream ivory color. It comes in, you know, your neutrals. Um, you have the black one that like, like kind of like a, like an apple green. I don't know. They're just so fun and so pretty. I wish they made it in like a purple. I would totally be all over that. Um, but yeah, definitely a bag that, you know, I would consider because it's just so fun and I think it's a great spring bag. But you guys know, um, I love this Cassie bag right here. The Cassie bag is so versatile. It has a gold chain, which I don't actually use with this, but I do have that upstairs. It comes with a crossbody strap. And then I just like holding it like this as a, um, as a top handle. Has this really great back pocket and you guys know what it looks like inside, but similar to the Pochette Matisse. It has these like dividers inside with a back. Um, also, what I really love, I don't have that in my collection, is the Cassie, again, right over here. It's also a bigger version of this. I just don't carry enough to have that, but I would say that size is more comparable um, to the Louis Vuitton Pochette Matisse. So if that's something that you are considering, but you're not sure if that type of bag is something that's gonna fit your style, fit your everyday, definitely check out the Coach Cassie. 
they have sales as well and as well in the department stores coach also does like yearly sales um, where you can really get a great deal and i think these retail from i would say like 250 to three something so again a fraction of the price um, and honestly i've been loving this one and you guys know that i absolutely love the senrev bags um this one i think is a little over 500 but you definitely get your money's worth the quality is just so nice um, these bags are made in italy and spain and you really get that like really detailed um with everything right like you can see here i've done a review on this i'll link that below but this one also the versatility of this one is amazing it comes with a strap on its own i actually have a guitar strap this but again, you can put a gold strap, you can put any strap you like on this. You can even just not use a strap and just use it as a handheld. This is the Aluna in the small size. Um, they have a regular size Aluna too that is bigger, that fits like a Kindle, I think a mini iPad. This one obviously doesn't because again, I don't carry that much, so I don't need big bags, but you can see that it comes in this really beautiful micro suede. A couple of pockets within that and within the bag for organization and the best part is so again the original straps that it comes with it actually see these four um, d-rings it turns into a backpack so if you are transitioning this let's say that you're you know like me i don't necessarily use backpacks but if i want to go to an amusement park or i just need a backpack for that day i can actually turn this into a backpack and when i'm done with that just put this back on and make it into a crossbody or a handheld. So love the versatility. Um, again, if this is something you're interested in, I do have a promo code. I'll drop that below. But Senrev has been, you know, a bag that I discovered, I will say, in the last year or two. And I've just been loving them ever since. And they have an Aria bag. I'll throw it up here. That is a belt bag. But again, it transitions into a crossbody. And I think it fits about the same as this, but they come in an array of colors. So if you want a pastel bag and you want something that's for fall, check them out. They have so, so, so many. Next brand I want to talk about is Longchamp. You guys know Longchamp has been around for a really long time. Um, most people, when you think of Longchamp, you think of traveling, you think of carefree, um, and it is, you know, very really really affordable and everything is mostly i mean they have leather bags and whatnot too but they're famous for their their nylon and i love this one i got this one last year um 2020 you know we weren't carrying much we wanted everything wipeable so this one gave me prada re-edition vibes um i do have the prada and Safiano, but i wanted to try out the nylon but i just didn't want to get the same exact bag um just because it was too similar but I got this instead, been loving it. It fits so much. This bag actually, I would say, fits the same amount as a medium size, just because you have this black pocket here, you have this big old pocket here, and then you have a side little pocket here, top handle, and I threw this little chain on just to give it that Prada look. And you can actually wear it like this. You can attach a crossbody. Um, great travel bag. And I figured, you know what? If I don't want to use this as a handbag anymore, this is also great for a pouch. So if you want to carry cosmetics, maybe you're you're traveling, you want to put all your toiletry in here, this is that bag that you can use for everything and put in your luggage. I absolutely love this bag also comes in different colors. I will drop that below if you guys are interested. And you guys all know the infamous, you know, just the, this is the Longchamp Club. This is the Longchamp La Pliage Club. I think I'm saying that right. I'm sorry if I'm not carrying your laptop, you're carrying things for work. You really don't want to have to lug up you know, like for me personally, like a leather bag that's heavy already. And then you have to put in more heavy stuff like notebooks and computers. Whereas this is so light, even if I fill this to the brim, I'm not gonna have any issues. I actually just have like a little organizer in here because it helps me organize, you know, stuff when I do need to go back to the office. Um, and I feel like this is just such a durable bag. So again, Longchamp is a great brand. Okay, and we all, no, 
Pelene because honestly, Pelene is one of the best contemporary bags. And if I had to pick one brand out of all the brands I've shared today, I would say Pelene would be my number one. I am really wanting the wallet on chain, I'll throw it up here. It's so cute and it's just, it's really impractical though, because you know, like, although I don't carry that much, I still wanna be able to put my phone in my keys and a sanitizer. And with that, you literally can only carry your credit cards. So that's why I've been, re I have not taken the plunge and purchased that. Cause just know that it's not gonna be that useful for me, but I still might get it just because look how cute it is. It comes in like this like burgundy red. It comes in like a ne neutrals. And I just think it will elevate any outfit. And I'm just, every time I see it, I just like want it so bad. But um, the, the plain bag I actually have right now is their Nano. Um, and this is the smallest size. You guys know I love this bag. It reminds me of a croissant. And the material, or I should say the, the leather, is a smooth calf skin. It's honestly so nice. And, and if you have not actually held a plane or seen it in person, you really will understand how nice this bag is until you do so. I like was on the fence. I didn't want to actually get this bag at first because I mean, although it looks cute, I didn't think it was that great. But honestly, for the price point, I believe this one is 300, um, but you can get like a pebble leather for I believe 250. And obviously the bigger size will be a little bit more, but it's not too much more, all under 500. And you just get so much um, quality. And again, these are made in France. You see there's feet on there, a top handle. You have this like really cute crossbody. Um, I mean, it's a really simple bag. It's just like this, but again, this is a timeless piece, and if you are looking for something within the $500 below range, definitely, definitely get the plane. Okay, the last two bags are just, you know, bags that I ran across and really didn't think about. One of them is my Zara bag, and I've been loving, like, the, the denim material. I know Chanel makes them. I know YSL has, like, a bunch of denim, new denim lot collection um, for this season. And I just love it, but I don't know if I'm gonna spend, you know, anywhere from 1500 up. I personally would rather get leather versus um, fabric. I just think you get more of your money's worth. However, I still love the denim look. So therefore, when I saw this, I was like, you know what? It doesn't hurt to just get it. And it's honestly such a big, I just have my makeup bag in there, but it's such a big bag and it's great. Like if you have kids, and I think this bag is like $50. So such a good, you know, just throw around bag. And then lastly is JW Pay. You guys, I did a video on this. I will drop it below, but they have a bunch of bags um, that are just more fun. I would say, I wouldn't say they're like, everyday bags, but I think for the price, you really get a good bag. I was surprised when I saw it. I actually discovered this bag watching YouTube videos and I was just more curious about it. Um, and when I saw that over the holidays, they had, um, you know, like a bunch of bags on sale. I was loving that like baguette feel. I was really feeling the Fendi. I just purchased my mama baguette and, I, and then I wanted to get my, you know, just a regular Fendi baguette. But again, I didn't want bags that were so similar. So I, but I love the shape of that. So I saw this bag and it kind of gave me, you know, baguette vibes. And I like this cream color. And you guys know that if I'm buying bags, I usually like to get darker bags just because I'm always worried about color transfer. But this bag I think is $40 or something around that, about under $50. So if you're spending only $50 on a bag or less, you know, it's okay to get some color transfer. So I opted for this cream color. Um, if you watch my other video on JW Pay, I actually gifted a couple to people and they also really love the bag, but I just love how like easy it is to use. And honestly, for the material, it, the zipper is buttery. I have it stuffed, but you can fit so much in this bag and it's just a great like, so if you guys haven't checked out JW Pay, definitely do so. Great, great, like just, you know, you wanna have bright colors and you wanna match outfits, check out that. So that is pretty much it. I just wanted to share the bags that I love that are 
great alternative, some other designer bags out there. If you like this, these type of videos, let me know. I can do more. Um, but yeah, happy spring again, everyone. And thank you so much for watching as always. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.